All Rusty RV TV, welcome. Check it out. We're just leaving the Great Smoky Mountain National Park. Wasn't that a cool ride through there? That was absolutely beautiful. We're in North Carolina. Actually, this is the town of Cherokee, North Carolina. We're going to stop, check it out. It's supposed to be a nice museum here, too. We'll try to find that. Cool fountain. I am not even going to try to pronounce that. This is the Cherokee Indian Reservation. What a neat fountain. Look at this thing. Crystal blue water. They have water here. Got a few clouds. I hit a few raindrops coming through the national park. Not bad. Right across the street, there's a mine. You can actually mine for minerals. Gem mine. Check it out. There's RVs actually parked right next to it, too. Looks like you can camp there. But look at the trees. There's look back up towards Tennessee and the National Park. But look at this tree-covered, beautiful area. I mean, you talk about plush. This is it. There's Cherokee. It's kind of split with a river. We're going to go run around town, check it out a little bit, see what's here. Well, I'm going to head towards that museum. I suppose I'm following my phone here. We're going to make a left up on this street. This is also US 441 that we cut through the National Park on. And I think this is it here when we make a left. Pretty good sized river. Ooh, I see a ice cream and candy store. <laughs> oh man. Look at that thing right on the river. Nice. What a setting. This is small town USA here. Got little shops. Green mountains in the background. Cloudy blue sky. kind of hungry. Here's a little cafe here. I want to see that uh, ice cream store up here. The Little Princess right on the river. Homemade ice cream. Like I need that. <laughs> Something there. Cherokee Rapids. Wow, look how shallow the river is. There's that ice cream store. Well, isn't that neat? You could have an ice cream, just check out the river. Watch the world go by there, huh? The Little Princess. Here you go. Check this thing out. Water wheel, huh? There's a mill store inside. Right along the river. Cool setting, huh? Nice little shops, cafe, coffee shop. Rustic looking. Pretty cool. All right, well, let's go find that museum. Cars all backed up at the gas station. I am here in the gas shortage. Go figure. Oh, man. To be continued on that. All right, according to the phone. Looks like we're about a mile away. Looks like fire department here. Some community. Oh, they're voting here today. Huh. Community buildings. That river is right off to the right. It looks like the river kind of splits the town. There's like a little valley here. There's a church on the left. And we make a right here. We're almost there. 
Wow, look at that motorhome. Hmm, man. That's a fancy couple of them. They're gonna cruise three of them. Wow. Hmm. Cruising the mountains. Hey, hey, I see the museum over on the left. We'll stop and check it out. Museum of the Cherokee Indian. Uh, high reviews. Very good <laughs> reviews online. Well, oh, there's the parking lot off the left. A couple dark clouds rolling through. Not bad, though. Here we go. Look at the flowers. Wow. Look at the color of those things. Oh, the rain, they're happy. Look at the sidewalk, painted sidewalk. Nice. Okay, well, let's go on in, check it out. Museum of the Cherokee Indian. I like these little museums like this. Well, let's go on in. It is super dark in here, so I'll do the best I can when we walk through. We'll check this out. It was uh, 12 bucks to get in. We got some storyboards here. Kind of hard to read. It's pretty dark. Camera struggling a little bit. Spirit of the Defenders. Here's some good lighting. I walked through a theater, but it was so dark, couldn't even see. Pretty good size arrowhead there. A lot of display cabinets. Wow, look at those stones. Imagine the history. Whole display there, more arrowheads. When I was a kid, I used to find those. Pipes. Look at the feathers on that. Came out of that guy right there. Beautiful mural painting. And animal skin pelt. Wow, the artwork in here is really something. Now that's cool. Look how the lighting just enhances that statue. Very well done. Some more pottery. Looks like big arrowheads. Very well done and very well laid out. I'm glad I stopped here. Medicine Man. These little museums like this are priceless. They uh, keep history going. What's this? All oh, games. That's how they play games. Kind of like a hockey puck thing. Huh. Chunky. I'll be darned. Isn't that interesting? Wow, look at that artwork. Wish the lighting was a little better. Look at the detail on it. Huh. Old plow, look at that. And we're walking. <laughs> 
Some old firearms in there. Pistol, rifles. My goodness, I thought them guys are real for a minute. Those are wax figurines. Wax men. Old shipping sails. Huh. Look how real those guys look. Like they're staring at you. There's old George. Wow, some old documentation. Look at this. It goes way back. Print and press. It's the way they used to do it. That is an antique. But the artwork in here is just beautiful. Look at that drawing. Battle of Horseshoe Bend. Wow, look at this. Huh. That is extremely well done. Look at the detail on it. John Ross, Major Ridge. Huh. I'm not that big of a history buff. I don't know all these details, but this statue is really powerful. Look at that thing. And the different tribes. I'll be darned. Cherokee. Wow. Seminoles. Nice. Look at that mural with all the covered wagons. That was photography back in the day. Everyone painted. Look at the detail on that one. If you get in this neck of the woods, you gotta stop. Check this place out. This is beautiful. Very historic. And pictures. These look more current. L look at all of them. A wall of life here. Just all kinds of history in this area. Through the generations. Very, very well done. Glad I stopped. Well, that's the end of it. For in here, they got a gift shop. Pretty big place, really. There's a room for all the veterans. All kinds of good stuff you can buy. Very nice. Well, what do you say? Let's keep cruising town. Check out some more of uh, Cherokee, North Carolina. Just stuff everywhere you see here. Nice. Georgia Blankenship. We gotta walk on this painted sidewalk before we go. In memory of 1918 and 1993. Looks like she supported or donated the property maybe. Look how they painted the concrete. Look at that. That is cool. Flowers. Got a bench. Just follow the path. That's a great idea.
I have no clue what kind of flower that is. What a color. Isn't that pretty? All right. Well, let's head for the van. I had to walk this. <laughs> hey, we're here. Why not? Cool. Well, I cheated. I look at the phone. We're gonna, there's another section of town we'll drive through. There's that river. But both sides of the river, there's a uh, town. So long museum. What a what a nice stop. It was well worth the 12 bucks. To go in there. There's a War Memorial Park up here. Let's check that out. Park is dedicated to Charles George. Nice memorial to him. Look at this memorial here to all the veterans from this area. All the different branches represented. Look at all the names. Wow. Cherokee, North Carolina. What a cool place. Keep going. This is scenic. Boy, I bet they get snow here, though. Oof. Elevation, I'm not sure. We got to be a couple thousand feet, I bet. Here's another park along the river. They even got a walking bridge across there. On the right, there's a Bureau of Indian Affairs, their big building. I think we make a left up here. This place is like one big park. <laughs> nice. There's another church. Okay, now that 441 kept going to the right. I'm going to find a campground here in a little bit. So this thing just kind of circles back around. We'll cruise down through here, see what's here. Well, off to the right is kind of like a strip mall full of little shops. Look at the architecture on the buildings. They're all kind of the same, real rustic looking. Fits the area. These buildings have been here a long time. This town's been here a long time. Small town USA right here. Another little mall. Pretty cool gift shops. Well, being this close to the National Park, think of the amount of traffic that rolls through here. I bet it's incredible for tourism. Wow, what's this big building up here? There's an old motel. Kind of like the Tennessee version of Route 66. Huh? <laughs> oh, a casino. That's what that is. That thing is huge. Harris. Wow, it's a Harris Casino in Cherokee, North Carolina. Wow. That thing's like 15 story high rise. Huh. 
There's another big building. I'll be darned. But they employ a lot of people here. All the fuel pumps are covered up. No fuel here. I'm going to have to search out some diesel. The good thing is the van, when it's full, gets really good mileage because of the Mercedes and the diesel and everything. I, I have over a 400 mile range when it's full. Well, I need to get turned around, head back towards the town, find that campground, figure out a plan. The Blue Ridge Parkway is right up the road. It's actually the beginning of it goes all the way up into Virginia so I'm gonna look at that look at the fuel problems here see what I can figure out stay tuned journey continues <laughs>